Hi YouTube, this is Jack from ENT Bites. Let's talk about the anatomy of the temporal fossa. The temporal fossa is essentially the region of the temporalis muscle, or around the temples, uh, if you feel your own skull. Um, so it's bordered superiorly and posteriorly by the superior and inferior temporal lines. Anteriorly, it's bordered by the frontal bone and the zygomatic bone. Uh, laterally, it is bordered by the zygomatic arch. Inferiorly, it is bordered by the infratemporal crest, uh, which is a line on the uh, greater wing of the sphenoid. The floor of the temporal fossa, uh, which is this area here, um, is formed by the bones that form the terion, um, which I'll draw over here. So the terion is essentially an H-shaped region um, formed by four bones, so the parietal bone, the frontal bone, the greater wing of sphenoid and the temporal bone uh, and that all lies uh, here in the uh, in the floor like this. Um, the roof of the temporal fossa is the temporalis fascia uh, and uh, lastly, the, uh, the contents are um, the temporalis muscle itself, which arises from the floor and also from the temporalis fascia, uh, and it fills out the fossa. So that's a, a basic overview of the temporal fossa. Thanks for listening. If you like the video, um, you can subscribe and see more anatomy videos. Bye.